right, welcome back to Get Out of the House, Go Fish. I'm fishing with a friend from work today uh, on his Mako boat. Uh, our target fish today is going to be sheep's head. Nabs picked up a few dozen shrimp from uh, the bait store, and he also picked up a few mullet. And uh, I'll be using a variety of baits today, uh, like some sand fleas, mussels, and some salted clams. So uh, we're, we're just getting out here for a few hours to fish. So let's see what we can hook into today. Let me see. I don't, I don't know what this is. I think it's caught underneath something. Yeah, it's caught underneath. Got there one? Go. Oh, yeah. That's the right species. Oh, yeah. Grab the net. Where's the doggone net? In the... <laughs> In the bucket. Oh, yeah. That's a good one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Keep this guy out. Shit. And then pop that. Yeah, there you go. Oh, brand new net, too. Yeah. Oh, oh my. I got it. <laughs> nice. Yes. That's a good All right. Size. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Good right, job. Me, uh, yeah, down right here. That's a good size one. Yeah. Dude. Good one. Yeah. Heck yeah. You had the shrimp. Yeah. All right. All right. Uh, like cut like a uh, uh, cut in half. Cut in half. Okay. Small. small. So the head off, just the tail on. Yep. Head off, and then I, if it's a big one, I cut that in half, and I put half of it just on the hook. Oh, there we go. Yeah? Yep. Where's the net? Oh, yeah. Right there by you. Oh, shit. So biting the shrimp. Oh, my God. Oh. No, what is... Porgy? There you go. People eat these, right? I think oh, so. I don't know what just fry this sucker up. Mm. It's a nice size one. Mm-hmm. Yeah, let me let them eat this first, and I'll get a shrimp. I feel like you're just chumming them up. Yeah, I think so. Get that chum out there for you. They're definitely eating it. They're eating good. Let me see one of those shrimp. There you go. Finally got me a fish. What is this? All right, all right. Same fish. I think it's the same fish you caught. Yeah. Same exact one? <laughs> Did you empty hole? <laughs> I don't know. Let me see. Go over there, buddy. I right, know I got the skunk out. I don't care any fish counts, man. <laughs> Got one? Get the net. Oh. oh. What? What? Oh, what? What? Is it the same That's one? it. No. <laughs> no. It's Are these another one. We, I, mean, I, I don't know. We're in a school this is a little smaller one, but. Hold on, buddy. Jeez. I really like the shrimp. They're pretty fish. They look like they taste good. You know what I mean? Yeah. Heck yeah. Let's see how... I don't know if he's a keeper though. Oh yeah, for sure. You think he is? Yeah, I can tell by looking at him. Well, wouldn't you know it, my uh, battery on my head cam died. I'm 
and then I hooked into the sheep's head before I could change the battery. So anyway, uh, here's the sheep's head I caught, and it measured out to be 13 and a half inches. He's like right there if he is. He's, me, def he's definitely. Let me get in my pliers. He's definitely. On that salt donkey. All right. Here we go. I was on the uh, the sand flea with a uh, a native salt bait, salted clam on there also. Just like that. That's what we call them. All. <laughs> <My style. laughs> That's it. You got it. You got one. That's it. Mr. Toadfish. Ah. Oh, she's huge. <laughs> Damn it. Look at his head. Yeah. Get those those pliers. I think you can lift them. No. <laughs> <laughs> Not lifting that. When I'm offshore fishing with new people that don't know me. I'll catch like a king or a wahoo. Oh, hell no. Can I just lift this to the picture? <laughs> no, 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 no. There we go, there we you go. You got it, you got it? That's a good one. That's a sheep, that's a sheep, that's a big sheep. sheep. Big sheep, big sheep, big sheep. That's what you're waiting, waiting on right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Man, they are fighters, too. There you go. Thank you. Hell yeah. All right, so we caught a few more of those ringtail porgies, and uh, we decided to go ahead and uh, check out another spot. So we left there, and uh, here we go. We're going down around uh, Chickapit Bay. Oh, that's a pedal hook? Yeah. yeah. That's pretty cool. Yeah. That's the island. Yeah. I figure we're bound to pick up some trout or something. We're coming down here, you know. On this bank. That shell, see that shell right there. Probably redfish are coming up feeding right there too. A mullet? Yeah, okay. Look, we got two. Look at that. All right. All right. See something. Get that guy. I fished the, uh, the inside of the bridge. Um, I caught, uh, I didn't catch any sheep's head, but I caught an oyster toadfish. <laughs> <laughs> uh. It looks like a good spot. Right? I, I mean, just hadn't, I just hadn't uh, caught anything. And I fished it twice already. Yeah, for sheeps. Oh, you did? Yeah. When was that? It's been a while ago. Like this year? Or? This past year, yeah. May try to okay. on Tuesday. Yeah, but he said he, he likes to, uh, I mean, he, what he does, he, t he works it with the, uh, he gets there right at high tide and works the outgoing tide. Uh, also, he said that the bite's heaviest about probably like four, 
four or five days before the full moon. Because it's, oh, oh. Oh, there you go. Yep. Is that the red? I don't know what it is, but it hit that fish bite paddle tail. It looks like a red. Yep. Here we go. Hell yeah. But, uh, let's see here. Nice red fish. Let's see how many spots he got. He's got one, two, three. You know, three spots. There we go. All right. He's probably right at. Uh, a lot of mullets out there, but they're gonna hit this. I'm shocked. They're gonna hit this. This fish bites paddle tail. That's the guy. <laughs> That's the magic. That guy. I've, I caught so many reds on this guy. Really? Yeah. On that particular one, that that green paddle tail. So cut the mullet up. Sometimes that cut mullet does better than live mullet. Right there. Got one? There you go. Another red. <laughs> All right. All right. Want the stagger? You're fine. He actually hit like right here. There's a little like sand out pouching, you see it? Mm hmm Yeah. Shit, this thing's running, dude. Yeah. Oh. Open this net. Open up. He's pulling drag hard too. It is. Oh, big is sheep's it? egg. No. Yeah. No, it's not. Holy cow. Holy Mike, shit. Mike. Mike. Mike, get ready. Get ready with this. Extend it all the way. Extend the other oh, handle. Yeah, yeah. No, no. There's, an, there's another extension. What? Yeah, right there. That other button. That other button. Yeah, there you go. Come on. Just keep him up. Oh, oh it's a, a big drum. Oh, drum. Oh man! Oh, look at that guy! <laughs> <laughs> wow! Oh, I didn't know this damn thing extended like that. Yeah, how badass <laughs> is that? That is badass. That's a big ass drum. How big is? That's the biggest drum I've ever caught. Oh wow! That's awesome. Yeah, I haven't caught a drum in a while, like years. A uh, black drum. I mean. And right there too, just right in the hole. Yeah. What'd you catch him on? Just shrimp? Shrimp. He's drumming. Yeah, he's drumming. Yeah. Heck yeah. Sweet. Oh. You gotta hold them up. You got some grips, fish grips. This. It's uh, seven pounds. I don't see. Got a picture? All right, that's it. I hope y'all enjoyed it. I uh, had a good time out on the water. It was a beautiful day that day. Um, caught those, uh, caught about a total of about four uh, sheep's head. Uh, probably about five or six of those ringtail porgies, but we threw those back. We weren't really sure, but I found out later that they were really good eating white meat uh, fish. And uh, next time we'll definitely keep those. Um, kept that drum and uh, those reds were too small. But anyway, uh, if you haven't yet, please hit that thumbs up, uh, subscribe to the channel, and uh, y'all get out of the house and go fish.